Hello everyone. I'm sorry today I look like a mess because I don't feel good. So yeah, I'm going to be showing you different things I bought for this little one that gets caught on everything. I bought for this little baby right here. His name is Spanky. He's my baby. Yeah. I love him. So, I'm going to be showing you different things that he likes to play with. Right now, he just went for this old toy that my other dog, Sparkles, had. And she still has. She actually has two of them. But she broke them. So, they're both like this now. So, they were used to just be like round toys. Let's see if I can find one. I don't think I have one right now, but I'll show you later. Um, and we also have like a lot of these toys are hand me down from my other dog Sparkle. She is a Yorkie, part Yorkie, part Shizu. And this little fellow is full blooded Shizu. So he's so cute. He loves his things. We had this Banky. <laughs> okay. We had this little owl. It's like foam. Like, not foam, but it's like a stuffed thing that has a squeaker. And we have one just like it. There's a fox. And they had different squeakers and everything. And these were two separate, like, bags of things that came like in this bag of toys and each of each one had like a color which this one was orange of course and it had like this little bone with little trees on it and the toy that it came with like the extra toy it came with was this one and they both came with ring toys and I'll go I'll go get the orange one so this is one of the ring toys. This is a star ring that it came with. Sorry, these are really disgusting because they are hand-me-downs. And my dog have had has had them for like three years because she's about to be six. And he is about to be nine weeks old. So he's really sweet. He's a little baby. <laughs> he's just loving it that all of his toys are just right here. But here is the orange star toy that came with these. <laughs> and the ring toys I was talking about, just like these, these used to have like little dots all over them like this. And I'm not going to give a close up of the other ones because they're really disgusting. So, um, I guess on to the next toy. Um... I got this in, like, we have this thing on Halloween where our whole street is filled with people just giving out candy and partying and stuff. And one of, um, like, Southern Properties, a brand or, like, agency or whatever, we're giving out these little green footballs. And this is his little squishy football. We gave this to my dog Sparkles a couple years ago. She's already taken the stuffing out of it. It's just a squeaker toy, but it's a Christmas shoe. We put it in her stocking. <coughs> Yay. And she has um, a chicken toy just like this, but it's also really disgusting because she's had it for years. And we got him a new one. And you're like, well, why didn't you get her a new one? Because it was her toy that you that you have. Well, we did get her another one, too. We got her purple chicken. And those squeakers. Uh-oh. But. They're different, so. Hey, buddy. Um, And we also got him another squeaker toy. It was this little baby thing pacifier whatever you want to call it dummy um binky whatever you want to call it 
But since he's a baby, he loves to play with this. So. Oh, his head just went up. Here you go. Okay. We also have these little bones that have like rope on the end because he loves rope toys. He loves, loves, loves them. And this one says barks and kisses. And it has a little rope toy on the end. He's too occupied with a squeaker toy. This squeaker is broke. But we also have another one that says, I woof you, and it has the rope at the end too, but it's squeaker works. So yeah, my dog Sparkles used to love this box and she loved it so much that she ripped the tail off of it because the stuffing's about to come out and he loves it now. So. I also gave him a tiger stuffed animal that needs to be washed right now because he he had a bad stomach one day and he threw up on it so um yeah another thing we got for him because he's a puppy and he chews on everything like if you've seen the video that I posted of me playing with him he would chew on my feet. He would chew on his toys. He would chew on everything. I don't know if I put that in the video, but I think I did. But he's just chewing on everything. So I got him a Nala bone. It's either bacon flavored or peanut butter flavored. So, yeah. I got a Nala bone. Okay, he's playing with another toy right now. And this next one is a hand-me-down. Also, it's this little just yellow and blue ball that we just roll around. And he loves it because it looks like a rat to him. So he goes. And then he tries to, like, kill it and stuff. And it's really cute. But since this one, you can see... He's already, like, started to take apart. So, when I went to Walmart the other day, we got him, we got him, like, four of these little things that's from Nerf, from dogs, for dogs, but it's from Nerf. It's just, like, these mini tennis balls, and he also loves to play with the regular size ones, too. He loves to roll them around, even though this one is as big as his head. If you want to know the size of my dog's head, just get a regular tennis ball or baseball or whatever. That's the size of his head. Now, since we're done with, I think, most of the toys. Oh, yeah. We also have this little rubber bone that twists and squishy for the dog, of course. But... Yeah, he also really loves to get all my scrunchies and hair ties and eat them. So, that's wonderful. <laughs> and I think that's pretty much it for the toys. Now we're getting into like more of sprays and brushes and treats and stuff. And like toothpaste and stuff. So... I have these, I got most of this stuff at the Pet Depot and at Walmart. They're really easy to find. Pretty sure you can get them at Target, too. We don't have a Target, so I don't really know. Um, but you can probably get them at Target. And he loves these little things. These are called Emerald Pet Little Choosies. They are peanut butter flavored. See, he, he want one? Do you want one? Oh my gosh. Here you go. That's a treat that I give him. He really loves it. So, those are the treats I give him. He's just chewing on it right now. Okay, and the next thing I have are um the next things I have not the next thing I have 
um, are, no, don't take your brush, okay, this thing, I spray on the puppy pad, and I spray on the grass outside, so, because we're still potty training him, so when we spray this on the puppy pad or the grass outside, he'll immediately be like, I should probably do my business here and not on my mother's bed. Ain't that right, Banky? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, did you just pee? Oh my gosh, he just peed. Okay. <laughs> um, okay. So, it does work, I promise. It's just... He's a little Peabody. So, this works really well. It's called Out. Go here, attract it. It's called Out. It's got a little Yorkie on it. Love it. What are you doing? What are you doing? What's that sound outside? I keep hearing something weird. Okay. So, this next thing I use for after his bath. He has not been able to get a bath yet. But when he does, I will put this on him. And I'm not sure how it works with him yet, but I do know how it works with my dog, Sparkles. She smells really good. It smells like you just came out of a dog groomer, like a professional dog groomer. And it smells really good. It's called Pothium. It smells really good. And after I put that in his fur, he's still wet, and I brush him with this. You might be like, it's just a regular brush, right? No, it's actually like a flexible brush. And you're like, most brushes are flexible. You can move the things, you know. But under the first pair like of bristles, you have... You have, like, a black layer of, like, <laughs> pokey bristles. <laughs> he loves this brush. I don't know why. But it's just good for thick furred dogs, especially Shizus, and some Yorkies, and a silk terrier. Or a poodle or something any dog that has thick fur <laughs> okay fun fact most do most zoos do not shed and most rookies don't either and i do this on both of the pups if they have like a bite from a flea after we get the flea off of them then we put this on it, Natural Care Plus. It You put it on their itch. And they stop itching. I'm going to go see what he's doing. Hold on. Okay, now I have proof that 